To a CARDIO 13 investigates update, the return to nature funeral home owners pleaded not guilty to a new set of federal charges today, but only one of them will be able to leave jail soon. CARDIO 13's Tyler Cunnington is in Denver tonight to explain. John and Carrie walked into a federal courtroom this morning bound by shackles, wearing colored jumpsuits. Their defense counsels both entering not guilty pleas on their behalf. However, after nearly two hours of discussion and argument, a judge ruled that John would have to stay in federal custody while his wife Carrie would be let go and allowed to live in a halfway house while this federal case plays out. The U.S. government arguing today the Halfords remain a flight risk due to a score of evidence showing they had a purposeful plan to avoid state charges by traveling to Oklahoma before their arrest last fall. They also said John owes over $22,000 in child care support and missed multiple court hearings for that case in Oklahoma for his only son. And now he's being investigated by Colorado Springs police for alleged sex offenses with a minor. A judge decided that Carrie had less involvement in the evidence presented today, letting her out of custody. I would expect them to plead not guilty. Um, I believe the evidence will far outweigh their plea. Um, I believe that the evidence will prove that they're absolutely guilty of all the charges. Um, so their not guilty plea doesn't bother me. Now, Carrie will appear here in Denver next week to have that halfway house assigned to her, as well as that new GPS ankle monitor. Reporting in Denver, Tyler Cunnington, Cardio 13 Investigates.